Welcome to the Sunflower State where the wind sweeps across the prairie and the sun glints off hidden waters teeming with life. We're on a quest today, a journey to uncover the best trout fishing spots in Kansas. Whether you're a seasoned angler or just casting your first line, these lakes offer something special for everyone. From the depths of Lake Shawnee to the flowing waters of the Canopolis Seep Stream, we'll explore diverse environments, each with its own unique charm and, of course, its own resident trout population. So grab your fishing gear, bait your hooks, and join me as we cast off on this adventure. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment below. Let's dive in. Our first stop takes us to the shores of Lake Shawnee, a sprawling reservoir covering over 1,000 acres just outside Topeka. Beneath its surface lurks a healthy population of rainbow trout, some reaching impressive sizes. I've heard tales of anglers pulling out trout pushing five pounds or more from these waters. When it comes to enticing these cunning creatures, I've found that power bait can be incredibly effective in Lake Shawnee. Something about that scent drives the trout wild. Of course a trusty spinner can also work wonders, especially if you're looking for a more active fishing experience. Just cast it out, reel it in with a seductive wobble, and be ready for that heart-stopping tug on your line. Remember, patience is key in fishing, and in life. But when you finally feel that telltale pull on your line, and you reel in a beautiful rainbow trout, glistening in the Kansas sun, you'll know it was all worth it. Lake Shawnee is more than just a fishing spot, it's an experience, a chance to connect with nature and test your skills against some truly impressive fish. Our next destination takes us just a stone's throw from the Missouri River to Leavenworth State Fishing Lake. This 160-acre lake is renowned among Kansas anglers, and for good reason. It's not just the abundant trout population that draws people here, although I can assure you, the trout fishing is exceptional. Leavenworth State Fishing Lake is all about convenience. With its well-maintained boat launches you can be out on the water, rod in hand, in no time. And if you're looking to extend your fishing adventure, the nearby camping facilities are top-notch. Leavenworth State Fishing Lake is regularly stocked with rainbow trout, ensuring a healthy and active population. So, if you're looking for a hassle-free fishing experience with the chance to land some truly impressive trout, look no further than Leavenworth State Fishing Lake. Hold on to your hats folks because we're about to dive into some legendary waters. Perry Reservoir, a sprawling giant spanning over 12,000 acres, holds a special place in Kansas fishing lore. This lake is where the current state record rainbow trout was caught, a behemoth weighing in at over 11 pounds. Perry Reservoir is home to a healthy population of trout, both rainbows and browns, ensuring that even if you don't snag the next record breaker, you're in for a thrilling fishing experience. When it comes to tempting these Perry Reservoir trout, I recommend trying your luck with some tried and true methods. Lures, especially those that mimic the movement of baitfish, can be incredibly effective. And if you're looking for a more traditional approach, you can't go wrong with salmon eggs. Perry Reservoir with its stunning sunsets and tranquil waters offers the perfect backdrop for your next fishing adventure. So pack your gear, grab your lucky fishing hat, and head on down to Perry Reservoir. Our next stop takes us to Webster Reservoir, a place where the fishing is as good as the food. This 4,000-acre lake is renowned for its healthy population of walleye, crappie, and of course our target species trout. And these aren't your average run-of-the-mill trout, we're talking about feisty, hard-fighting rainbows and browns, eager to put up a good fight. Now what makes Webster Reservoir truly special is its proximity to some fantastic dining options. Whether you're in the mood for a juicy burger, some fresh-caught seafood, or even some authentic Kansas barbecue, you'll find it all within a stone's throw of the lake. Webster Reservoir offers plenty of options for camping. But Webster Reservoir is more than just a fishing spot. Our journey now takes us to a place steeped in history and teeming with life, Glen Elder Reservoir, also known as Wakanda Lake. This sprawling body of water covering over 12,000 acres holds a special allure for anglers and history buffs alike. Legends say that Native American tribes once considered this lake sacred, a place of power and mystery. Glen Elder Reservoir is also a prime destination for modern-day anglers, especially those seeking a thrilling trout fishing experience. The lake is regularly stocked with rainbow trout, ensuring a healthy and active population. When it comes to enticing these Wakanda Lake trout, I recommend trying your luck with some night crawlers. Of course you can also experiment with lures, especially those that mimic the appearance and action of baitfish. The surrounding state park offers a variety of amenities, including camping facilities, hiking trails, and picnic areas making it the perfect place to spend a weekend or even longer. Hold on to your fishing rods, folks, because we're heading to a place where the trout are as big as the smiles on the faces of the anglers who reel them in. Cedar Bluff Reservoir, 
This sprawling reservoir covering over 6,000 acres is renowned for its trophy-sized trout, some reaching lengths that would make even the most seasoned angler's jaw drop. When it comes to tempting these behemoths, you'll need to bring your A-game. Lures, especially those that mimic the movement of baitfish, can be incredibly effective. Spoons, spinners, and crankbaits are all good choices, and don't be afraid to experiment with different colors and sizes until you find what works best. The surrounding area offers a variety of camping and dining options, ensuring that you'll be well-fed and well-rested for your next fishing adventure. So, pack your gear, grab your lucky fishing hat, and get ready for an unforgettable experience at Cedar Bluff Reservoir. Our pursuit of Kansas trout now leads us off the beaten path, away from the sprawling reservoirs and into the heart of the Smoky Hills. Here, nestled amidst rolling hills and whispering grasslands, lies a hidden gem for anglers seeking a unique and rewarding experience, the Canopolis Seep Stream. Fed by natural springs, the Canopolis Seep Stream maintains a cool, clear flow year-round, creating an ideal habitat for trout to thrive. The stream is teeming with rainbow trout, eager to strike at a well-presented lure. But what makes the Canopolis Seep Stream truly special is its intimate setting. Gone are the crowds and the clamor of larger lakes. When it comes to tackling this unique stream environment, I recommend packing light and opting for a more delicate approach. Spinners, small spoons, and even flies can be incredibly effective in these waters. Our next stop takes us to a place where family fun and fantastic fishing go hand in hand, Vicks Lake, nestled within the picturesque Sedgwick County Park. Now this 8-acre lake may not be the largest on our list, but what it lacks in size, it more than makes up for in charm and accessibility. Vicks Lake is the perfect place to introduce youngsters to the joys of fishing. The shoreline is dotted with easily accessible fishing piers, ensuring that anglers of all ages and abilities can cast a line and experience the thrill of the catch. And with its calm waters and gentle slopes, Vicks Lake provides a safe and welcoming environment for families to enjoy a day out on the water. When it comes to enticing these Vicks Lake trout, I recommend keeping it simple. Power bait, worms, and small spinners are all effective choices. Our quest for Kansas trout now leads us to a place of tranquility and natural beauty, Lake Henry, nestled within the sprawling embrace of Clinton State Park. This 132-acre lake surrounded by rolling hills and verdant forests offers a serene escape from the hustle and bustle of everyday life. As you launch your boat onto the glassy surface of Lake Henry, a sense of calm washes over you. The air is alive with the sounds of nature, the chirping of birds, the rustling of leaves, the gentle lapping of water against the hull. Beneath the surface of Lake Henry lurks a healthy population of rainbow trout, eager to test your angling skills. When it comes to tempting these Lake Henry trout, I recommend trying your luck with a variety of techniques. Trolling with lures that mimic the movement of baitfish can be incredibly effective, as can casting spinners or spoons near drop-offs and submerged structures. Lake Henry is more than just a fishing spot. Our final destination on this Kansas trout fishing adventure takes us to a place that truly embodies the spirit of the Sunflower State Tuttle Creek State Park, home to the picturesque Willow Lake. This sprawling park, with its rolling hills, dense forests, and sparkling waters, offers something for everyone, from seasoned anglers to families seeking a memorable outdoor experience. Willow Lake, nestled within the heart of the park, is a haven for anglers seeking a variety of fish species including our target quarry trout. The lake's cool, clear waters provide an ideal habitat for rainbow trout, and the population here is known for its size and fighting spirit. Tuttle Creek State Park is more than just a fishing destination. With its miles of hiking and biking trails, its well-maintained campgrounds and its abundance of wildlife, the park offers endless opportunities for exploration and recreation. After a successful day on the water, why not set up camp under the stars and enjoy the peace and tranquility of the Kansas prairie? As the sun begins its descent, casting long shadows across these Kansas waters, we come to the end of our journey. We've explored hidden streams, sprawling reservoirs, and everything in between, discovering the best trout fishing spots that Kansas has to offer. But remember the true reward lies, not just in the catch but in the experience itself, the thrill of the fight, the peace of nature, and the memories created along the way. Thanks for watching, remember to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. See you at the next great fishing spot.